Hello, welcome. Uh, in this video, we're looking at the New York State tax table. Um, and we're assuming I chose the table as married, filing jointly, or qualifying widower. Um, so what are we doing here? Well, assuming the taxable income is 20000 so your the income you're going to be taxed on is $20,000, what would your New York State tax equal? So we're just looking at how to read this table, essentially. Here, if you take 20000 and go to your table, you realize it falls in this bracket because it says, if line 38 is, it refers to a previous part of this form, over 17,150, but not over 23,600, so between those two numbers, that's where our number is, the tax is $686, so let's write this down, 686, plus 4.5%, that's 0 0.04, Five of the excess over, and all these quotation marks just repeat that statement of the excess over. In this case, seventeen thousand one fifty. So all the money you have above that. So in your case, all the money you have above seventeen thousand one fifty is going to be your twenty thousand, your taxable income minus seventeen one fifty. That's going to tell you how much do I have. I mean, you should track twenty thousand minus that number. How much do I have past 17,150? I'm going to multiply that by 0 0.045, add 686, and I have my total New York State tax here, um, assuming that's all I'm dealing with is income tax. So let's just pull up a calculator there. All right, so we got 686 plus 0 0.045. Oh boy, I'm in an old problem there. Who don't need that? Okay, so 686 plus. 0.045 times 20,000 minus, what is that, 17,150. 17,150. That's your, the number I graphed on the table. Hit enter. And we get $814.25. So $814.25. Now, I mean, in this table, as you go, further into it, you just fall into different brackets. So if you had $100,000 in taxable income, you'd fall in this bracket, you'd pay 2,000 plus 6.33% of the excess over 43,000. So essentially, in your equation, this number would change, right, your different income bracket minus the excess number right here. And then this percentage would change 6.33%, so 0.0633. And the starting baseline of your tax would be not 686, but 2093. All right, hope this helped.